Hey guys, it's me, Shigami Honey. I'm back. Um, I wanted to show you my trim and do a little rant. Um, like I said in my last video, I was going to get a trim because I had grown my hair out for the last mm, three or four months and I just needed some dead ends cut off and I wanted um, just a trim. I wanted to keep my length and it's very hard to find um, someone where I live that specializes in natural hair. Um, and what I mean specialized, not just flat ironing natural hair, but taking care of the health and maintaining it, using the right products, um, and so forth. So the one woman that originally big chopped me, she never got back to me. Um, I did move an hour away, so I'm not consistent with her and I really don't go in to get my hair trimmed every three months maybe every five months or if i feel like i have like a disaster that i need cleaned up so this time i got my hair trimmed three months ago maybe four months i think it was three months ago so it was time so uh she never called me back so i went to um a woman that i used to go to that used to color my hair she is now um on another part of town but it's a little bit closer long story short I told her that I didn't want any length taken off. I just wanted the dead ends. And as you can see, I have a bob. <laughs> I have a bob. And as she was cutting, uh, I stopped her and I said, I, I don't like the length that you're taking off because she started in the back and she cut me curly. And we know when you cut curly hair, there's shrinkage. And, you know, she said the shrinkage is real. I'm going to show you what I'm cutting off. Um, I can see what you're cutting off. Uh, you're cutting off my length. So I kind of relaxed a little and I said, let me just trust her because she cut me six months ago and that's how my hair grew into the shape that it came to be in my last video. I love that shape. I had, you know, a little hang time and it was growing out nicely. But like I said, you know, I have alopecia and my hair was thinning and, so, um, this is the end result. It's a bob. It's a bob. It's, um, short in the back. And she said, oh, girl, your hair will be back in two weeks. Um, no, it won't be. Uh, like I told you before, I have alopecia. And I seen you six months ago, and the length that you see, it took me six months to get to that length. Um, despite the trim that I had in between. Um, so I was like kind of upset. I'm still kind of bummed out because I'm trying to grow my hair out and it's like my hair won't let me be great. It just won't let me be. So anyway, I got a bob. I parted it kind of diagonal and, um, this is what I got. So my front is still this like almost the same length. Like she cut very little off. I told her to cut a quarter inch off and she said well I'm gonna take a half inch off and I guess you know it doesn't matter what I say um the stylists are gonna do what they want to do so um she did show me a technique to style my hair um as she always does I I'm not bashing her because she's a good stylist it's a good hairdresser um I just feel like some people are scissor happy um, and she explained if I don't get the ends trimmed off now, then, you know, three months from now, more hair is going to be taken off and I should get my hair trimmed every three months. I don't agree with that because if you don't need your hair trimmed every three months, don't get it trimmed every three months. You're cutting off your growth. If you're not heat styling and over manipulating your hair, then your hair should be good. So it all depends on, um what you do to your hair. So to style my hair, I use the Mixed Chick Sleeve and Conditioner. I used to use this a long time ago. I use the Eco Styler um, Black Caster and Flexi Oil Gel. And then to kind of lighten up the gel, I use my Design Essential Compositions Foaming Wrap. Um, I use foam anytime I style my hair. I may not tell you guys, but when I put gel on my hair, uh, if I feel like it's too heavy, I put the foam in there. And then I sprayed it with the Design Essentials Reflections Liquid Shine. 
So this is what I got. Um, the first day it was really big. Um, and then I washed it that night because when I took a nap, my hair was like matted down like a baby afro. And I was like, wow, I'm, I was, wasn't even out of the TWA stage and I'm like back in it, but with a bob that I didn't want. So, um, it's going to get bigger. Um, this part will get bigger and this part will get bigger as the week goes on the back. Um. I mean, it looks a mess right now. Let me fix it up. I don't like this situation going on right here. Like, I don't like it. Um, so, I have to play around with this style. But, there's no denying that I have a taper cut again, which I didn't want at all. I wanted everything to be even. My front and my back. So, but that's it. This is what it's looking like. My curls are popping. They're soft. Um, I didn't get any breakage. There was no shedding in the shower. Um, my hair feels healthier. It's soft. It's moisturized. It doesn't look as dry. So, yes, I did need a trim. I didn't want a haircut. But that's life, right? So, until next time, bye.